This video is protected by fair use. It is not for profit. Thank you. Bro has the ultimate gorilla look. Only thing is missing a gorilla body. So maybe this is his sign to go to the gym and pick up the weights because if this man would get buff, he would look like a literal gorilla. People be saying he missed the update. He was the first human to evolve. And also what in the Star Wars universe is this? My man doesn't have it easy, but he doesn't care. You know, he makes videos, he makes fun. He jokes around and I think he makes a bag. And also he can skate. So he picks up a hobby and does it because he loves it. But tell me what you guys think about this down in the comments. Man, don't forget to make those gains and catch you. So basically this is a video made by a gym bro, Tommy Gaines. About this man, I'm not sure what his name is, to be honest. I don't think it was mentioned in the video. But this is pretty sad. I mean, to ridicule someone that's born that way, he has a condition, he didn't choose that. He hasn't harmed others. All right. Um, doesn't, as somebody wrote here, he is a human being, doesn't deserve to be ridiculed. He didn't choose to be born like this. And over 2,000, 2.6 thousand people like that comment, which is good. And it shows, you know, it, Shows there are some good, decent people around still. Sometimes it seems like there aren't, if you see what I'm saying. It can be very depressing. But, uh, I mean, why would somebody bully that guy over the way he looks? And I know there's going to be some demons coming to my channel or saying, what a hypocrite, he makes fun of the way people look. Yeah, it's after they've attacked me, after they've verbally attacked me, lied about me, slandered me. They've done something to warrant my responses. Do I tease people then? Yeah, I do. Absolutely. Angry Gingy, for example? Absolutely. I knew that was a soft spot, but had he said shit about me, started shit with me, when I had never said shit about him? Yeah, he did. He really did. He started shit. So did Sedaris. So did the others. I mean, we P33, all of them, the whole list. So is that me being a hypocrite? No, I'm not just picking somebody at random and bullying them. I don't do that, all right? Especially when someone has a medical condition or they're born that way. I scrolled through these comments and uh, th there are some good dudes out there. Mad respect for this dude. I don't like this part, you know, of course, but... uh Somebody wrote, God made them like this, and they're laughing. I don't think it's funny. Can you imagine the strength that guy has to have to go through life, to go to the beach, to be on video, on videos, uh, on camera, out in public, you know, at the beach, places like that, where there, there's people that don't want to take their shirt off at the beach. There's uh, men and women like that, big dudes that are 350 or whatever. They don't want to take their shirt off at the beach or they're embarrassed or whatever, right? There's women that don't want to wear a bathing suit to the beach because they're embarrassed of their body. So massive respect and thumbs up to that guy for having confidence, for being a warrior, for going through life this way. He didn't choose to look like that. Um, I don't know the guy personally. I don't even know his name, but... Um, still ch looking for that comment that I saw earlier. Um, still looking for it, scrolling down here. Yeah, he doesn't deserve it. I, so I agree with a lot of these comments. Here it is. Here it is right here. Barber Say syndrome is a very rare condition characterized by the association of excessive hair growth, hypertrichosis, papery thin and fragile atrophic skin, outward turned eyelids, 
ectropion. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing some of this stuff. These are the first time I've seen these words today in my life. And a large mouth, prostomia, it has been described in less than 20 patients in the medical literature. So that's how rare it is, very rare, extremely rare. So anyway, um, he goes to the beach, he skates, skateboarder, do your thing, bro. If you ever watch my video, I don't know if you'll ever come across this video of mine, but more power to you and fuck the haters in this realm. The ones that try to bully people for things they didn't choose, things they can't help. And especially guys that have not harmed someone. They're not going around trashing everyone. They're not lying. They're not slandering. They're not starting smear campaigns. They're not lying about them. All the things that the, the demons do, the creatures, the Sedaris, the Chrissy Crybabies, and the Wee P33, and, you know, the Lion Sword, and Forever Con Man, and uh, Anne Marie Huber, and Yassan Cockroach, and, you know, all these fucking creeps on YouTube that start shit, and then they just can't take it. The Granny Smiths can't even show her face, yet she f shows my face zoomed in close up. And it wasn't that way. I don't like my face filling up the screen. And they do that. I mean, it doesn't harm me, but it's just pathetic because they're so cowardly and weak. And they attack someone else's looks or whatever. Uh, there's been quite a few women on my channel that have said, hey, Stephen, you're a hot guy, you're handsome, all this stuff. So they can shove it up their ass, if you know what I'm saying. I had no trouble my whole life getting girlfriends or having girls interested in me. Um, that's the way it is. I'm not boasting about it. And I do feel bad for... The guys out there, there's a lot in this realm that have trouble getting any women interested in them or attracted. And uh, there's a lot that are virgins that are 20, 30, 40 years old, you know, and it's, it's sad. It's not it's not something that I go around making fun of and putting down. And yeah, I might make the odd comment uh, in retaliation. I want to I want to stress that towards demons that have already attacked me and been vicious, uh, attacked me tried to attack my mother, my deceased mother, use everything they could grasp at against me, then yeah, sometimes I do lash out at those demons. Do I do that to everyone? No, I don't. Definitely not. Definitely not. I would never attack someone that's kind, that's gentle, that's a good spirit, good soul, whatever, whatever way you want to put it. Um, if they're deformed, if they're, they have a mental illness or they have a mental handicap, physical handicaps, you know, all sorts of things. I don't, I don't go around ta attacking them, and I'm not like the demons. All of them seem to call everyone fucking retards. So they don't care about mentally challenged people, obviously. They really don't. Sedaris, Wee P33, Lion Sword, that whole group, you know, they're just disgusting, man. They're really disgusting. They are demons. So if you want to feel sorry for the demons, I mean, that's your choice, but... I feel sorry for people that have conditions that they didn't choose and they have to deal with living that way in this, in this fucked up hell realm. And it is painful and it's heartbreaking. But I hope this guy has the best life possible. He seems to be doing, handling it better than most would, but probably better than I would, to be honest, if I was born that way. Let's face it, that would be tough because other people are, it's hard enough as it is. All right? So my heart does go out to him. That guy would be welcome on my channel, definitely. And uh, it's not his fault. He looks different. He has a rare condition, okay? He's not someone that didn't evolve. Evolution is a lie. And it's just a cheap shot, people that use this for views. This channel that has over 200,000 subscribers used, that, used him for views to get over 537,000. And this just popped up. YouTube recommended this. It was just right there. And I clicked on it, okay? And I just decided to cover it. I watched it twice. First time and then the second time was when I recorded it. So, kudos to the guy in the video. Not, not this channel, not this Tommy Gaines Jimbro 
that uh, just wants the views and attention and has to put someone down. It's pathetic, man. That guy didn't do any harm to you. This guy did not har do any harm to you, Tommy Gaines. All right? So that's sickening. That's my view on it. So I wanted to explain because the demons will say, hypocrite, he's a hypocrite. He, he makes fun of, fun of people's looks. And yeah, people that have done harm to others, people that rip, rip off others, felons, sex offenders. Yeah, I do. I do attack them. I've never said once that I don't. I've never lied and never said, no, I don't do. I do attack those demons on Team Evil. Do I attack innocent guys like this? No, not, not at all. Not at all. Someone that has a medical condition, a rare condition, or deformities, or whatever the case may be. All right? It's not his fault. This is a perfect comment, this one right below mine. Because he doesn't deserve to be ridiculed. He didn't harm others. He doesn't go out of his way to harm others. And that's the point. That's what I wanted to stress here. So... I wish I wish that guy all the best in life. Hope he gets as much enjoyment as he can skateboarding, going in the ocean, stuff like that, doing what he enjoys. Thanks for watching, everyone. Take care. Bye.